fellow losers. How's everybody doing tonight? Sorry, it's just the kit show tonight. No Dale, he's teaching. I think it was Chunk who was saying that uh, he didn't ever have a college professor who was as entertaining as Dale. Boy, I'll bet not. And I went to a Catholic college, so we never had anybody that entertaining. Um, that's his two nights a week job. He has a regular job during the day where he is um, an assistant controller for um, uh, an electric co-op. Um, and he has a bunch of tax clients, too. So anyway, he's a busy boy. So I'll be vlogging by myself tonight. Um, yeah, when he rolls into school to teach, oftentimes he's on the Harley wearing full leathers, chaps, boots, gloves, the whole thing. So, yeah, he's, he's the cool professor, I guess. I think he's the nutty professor, but he's pretty handsome when he's all dressed up like that. So, yeah, I'm not stupid. Anyway, um, I'll give you our results for today. We are on round, I am on round two, he is on round one. Uh, P2 VLCD number three. And I am down 2.4 today. So I am down um, almost all my loading weight. I am only 0.8 above my um, last dose weight. So, you know, in two days I've lost almost all my loading weight because I maintained my... Um, my last dose weight throughout my P3 puts me down a total of 5.8, which is really good. Um, my ketones in my urine, somebody was mentioning um, about um, the ketone. They weren't sure what I was talking about in my urine. I will, um, I don't have them right here, but I will um, put in a picture of the ketone sticks right Okay, everybody, here are the um, ketone strips. You can get them anywhere, CVS, Walgreens, Walmart, you name it. And pee on the stick, match it up. I don't know if that's better or worse. But you see it tells you trace small, moderate, large. And they're just little, you know, just little strips. Got a little pad on the end. Anyway, that's it. Here. And we're back. So that you can see. Yeah, every morning you pee on a stick. And the darker it is, the more ketones you have, the more fat you're burning. So I'm a little concerned. I didn't really keep good records at the very beginning of my homeopathic round. So I can't remember when my ketones um, started to go up. But they were, you know, I was moderate to high the whole time when I was on homeopathic. So, um, you know, I'm going to keep monitoring that. You know, I did drop, so I'm not as concerned. And I was getting a little frustrated. I was thinking, oh, I got home today and I was starving. I was so hungry. I was starving. I made some chocolate delight. I did something to it. It came out lumpy. I don't know what I did. Tasted okay. Didn't stop me from eating three pieces. So hopefully that won't be reflected in my um, results tomorrow. But I was starving. I do remember having to up my dose on the drops. I was doing 20 drops three times a day. I'd really like to know how to calculate how I should adjust my injection dose based on that, but it's hard to know how much was even in those drops. I'm at 150 units. Both Dale and I are doing 150 units. Sub-Q. Shot. Um, so I went back to my, um, you know, I was a little discouraged. I was thinking, oh, is it really coming off? Why are my ketones not up? So I went back to my results from my first round. And um, at the same point on my first round, I had only dropped four pounds, and um, so far I've dropped 5.8. So I feel a little better about that. I just wish I weren't so hungry. You know, I I broiled some radishes because I really do like radishes. That didn't help. Um, Dale had wanted miracle noodles tonight, so I made miracle noodles with some um, 
tomato sauce, you know, no sugar, no added sugar or anything like that, and bison, you know, the 3.5 ounces of bison. So, I mean, and I feel I'm not, I, I'm full right now, so that's good, and I haven't had my second fruit yet, so that's really good. But um, I was really hungry. You know, my teeth are bothering me. I, don't, I didn't have that problem on the first round, and I know some of you have said that with injection, your, your teeth bothered you a little bit. I don't have teeth problems. I probably have three fillings in my whole mouth. So um, I don't know. And I am taking, you know, all the vitamin supplements, all the, you know, calcium, vitamin D, magnesium, all that stuff. Um, let me give you some of Dale's stats for today. That stink bomb. He was down 5.6 pounds today. Can you believe that? Men. For a total of 8.2 on VLCD number three, I think I'm in for a really big fight. <laughs> I think he's going to kick my butt during this um, part of it. Anyway, um, but he's doing really well. Um, the hunger is better for him today, and he was um, doing fine. He took some Grissini breadsticks so that at school, if he got hungry, he'd have a little something to nosh on. Um... Oh, Angie, baby, I went in on the P10,000, Kelly. I want in. Um, I'll bring um, pecan pie and some uh, peach pie. Just uh, Angie, is it Angie? Yeah, Angie. Angie, just tell me, honey, where can I hook up the camper? Where's the power at? I will hook up that camper, too. Don't think I won't. We won't put you out of your house. Anyway, I want in. That sounds like a blast. You know, I haven't spent any time in Arkansas, so that would be fun. We could come up from Georgia. Um, Kelly, water. Drink your water. Later on in this vlog, we will have a pee break, just so that you know. No need to cross your legs, everybody. Um, today for lunch, I had um, chicken and a tomato and an apple. And that's pretty much, my lunches are pretty simple. Um, I cooked up all the um, chicken last night. I put Frank's hot sauce, marinated in that, and a bunch of spices, put it on the George Foreman, and cooked up a whole bag and measured it out and everything. And I just keep it sort of grab and go in the fridge. And Dale um, has a salad for lunch and um, grabs that chicken to go and puts it on there. So... Um, I am looking for a recipe. I am trying, I'm going to try and develop a recipe for coleslaw because we can have cabbage and my MCT oil came today. So I'm going to try that and I'm going to make some of Heavy Dobby's um, mayonnaise and I'm thinking I might be able to tweak it a little with stevia and some seasonings and, and um, end up making some coleslaw that would be P2 friendly. Stay tuned. Um... I hope those miracle noodles do okay for me. Oh, um, somebody asked me about my MSM. Um, MSM, I got the capsules from GNC. I take 2,000 milligrams um, in the morning and 2,000 at night. I decided I'm just going to do the capsules while I'm on P2. Um, once I go to P3, I'll start putting the powder back in the um, smoothies, the protein smoothie. The powder I got at the vitamin shop. And they do have a .com, vitamin, the vitaminshop.com, that you can order it from. But I, I went into a store and bought it. So um, this tastes terrible, though. I put it in my tea. I also put it in our strawberry smoothies last night. Wouldn't recommend it. Oh, it's bitter. So that's my plan. Also, the MSM soap I meant to show you last night. This is the MSM soap that I ordered off of Amazon. So, and I really like it, especially for my face. I need to look for that um, that um, um, NAPCA spray. I think somebody said they got it at Ulta. But um, Heavy or um, Genuine Latina Girl, if you could um, just make a comment and tell me where you got it from. Because um, I really do want to try that. Uh, water counter. Um, Heavy Dobby said she might do a vlog on how to make a water counter. This is what it looks like. 
And when you when you have um, another bottle of water, you just pull that down, pull it down, and then for the next day, you just put them all back up again. Well, that's not working very well. But you put them all back up again, and then you pull one down. Whenever you're ready, and you can use whatever beads you want. And this is just you know one of those clips that you can put on there. I made some short ones for people at work who have the giant cups. Um, so I made some just some little short ones so they can put on the handle. The other thing is about the um, the Excel spreadsheet. Uh, I'm working out, I'm going to resend it out to everybody. Um, I sent it to Georgia Peach to see if, if it's been corrected. And then once I get it back from her and everything's good to go, then I'll send it back out to everybody else. Um, I mean, on my computer, the drop-down boxes work, but it, it's a Mac to Microsoft issue. So I, Dale fixed it at work, sent it to me on Microsoft. I got it in my AOL, and I just need to make sure when I send it out that the boxes work. So anyway, enough about that. Anyway, everybody, I hope you have nice, good releases, good stabilization. It's nice to see the besties back on P2. It's also great to see hotties can't gain. Finally have a vlog again. I love all my new subscribers. Thank you, everybody. The comments are wonderful. And um, I hope everybody does great. And I will. we will be talking you, to you tomorrow night. Losers.